We're here at the 10th World Meeting of Families in Rome, right outside Paul VI Hall, where all the conferences take place, where families hear lectures, but also testimonies and share their experiences about life and faith and family life. Let's have a look together. How do you like it here at the World Meeting of Families? It's an amazing experience. We've been here now for five days, I think. Uh, it's a little bit hot, but it's really nice. The Romans are very kind to us. What will those families take back from the World Meeting of Families to Burundi? What will they have learned? Love, uh, pardon, yes, reconciliation, but uh, also to accept the challenges in the family. It is uh, normal. Right now there's a break, so the families are out for a couple of minutes. We we'll still will try to interview a few people. So this is the right way to come to a world meeting of families with two strollers. That's very impressive. What's your name? Brian Tran. Hannah Tran. Hannah Tran. Where are you from? Australia. How was it so far at the world meeting of families? Oh, amazing. I got inspired a lot from the Abdullah family today, where forgiveness, love and also faith, grow a family in faith. Like my wife, the Abdullah family, who are part of our delegation, have really uh, blown us away and I think the rest of the people here as well have been uh, so blessed by their story, the story of forgiveness and redemption. Hi, sorry, could I ask you a few questions in English? Sure. Okay, what's your name? I'm Sydney. I'm Catherine. Where are you from? Um, we are representative of Iceland, Reykjavik. Of Iceland, so yes. wow! So you came all the way from Iceland to Rome. How are you finding the World Meeting of Families? I'm, I really like it. I'm very amazed. The most inspiring are actually the testimonies because most of the times you think, with all your doubts and your fears about being modern-day Catholic, that it's hard to live and you're all by yourself. You feel this sense of community. That last story was really beautiful and touching. People are yearning for forgiveness. What that family had to go through. Lost their kids and really had to learn to forgive the person who killed the kids and just learn to forgive themselves. I think that is it was just a beautiful story. Going back to the U.S., what will you share with your friends and families back home? Um, definitely um, just the impactful message of forgiveness and just understanding how unified the Catholic Church is and seeing that all these different families from different backgrounds, there's this lovely unity and we can just see God's love through each and every family despite differences. Cari genitori, la parola di Dio ci mostra la strada. Mass with Pope Francis is wrapping up here in St. Peter's Square during the 10th World Meeting of Families. The pilgrims will be sent out after the Angelus back into their home dioceses, not only to bring the good news of the Gospel, but also to share what they've learned here at the 10th World Meeting of Families in Rome. And now as they make their way out from St. Peter's Square, we're going to ask the pilgrims what this will be. It was a very great and a wonderful experience having uh, uh, being here. We uh, experienced struggle in our life, so this is so very helpful in our married life. And so we want to bring these uh, things out all to our community as we go home to Philippines. Couples and engaged lay people, men and women, are working so strongly for the pastoral of families. They're really giving the open heart, they're engaging families to make networks of families, to make them active. What will you take back with you? Uh, well, um, happiness and, and we found well, um, Jesus Christ, our faith that is alive. We want to repeat it maybe in 2025 uh, with more kids, <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> You see the beauty of the world family coming together, especially like a great time for like lay people to come and really be a part of the church's evangelization meeting through the institution of the family, because it all starts there and it builds up. Yeah.